school's right around the corner and many kids will be getting there by taking the bus. There are safety rules they'll need to know and KX News reporter Sanji Milburn tells us what people should know both on and off the bus. Thousands of kids will be heading back to school in a few weeks and for many, their day will start and end by riding a bus. I feel like when it comes down to it, it's a lot safer to have a few vehicles on the road than everybody on the road. Kay still is just one of many parents who finds a school bus convenient. Her son has been riding the bus for two years and he's only five years old. And as a bus driver herself, safety is important not only to her child, but others. The minute we started riding the bus, I started making sure that he knew that he had to be seated. He needed to keep his hands to himself, make sure that he was doing everything that I asked him to do. Partly because I wanted him to be a good example for the other kids that are on the bus, especially with him being my child. But not everyone has a parent who is a bus driver. So what are school bus safety tips? Remain in your seat at all times. Keep hands, feet and arms inside the bus. Talk quietly because the driver needs to concentrate. And if people are leaving the bus, the people in front leave first. Students should be at least 15 feet away from the bus on the sidewalk. And when the bus arrives, don't be in a rush to get on, even if the door is open. Wait until the driver instructs you. And drivers on the road aren't off the hook. When the bus red lights are on and the stop arms are out, do not pass the bus on any side. A couple years ago, we did have a student that was hit by a car that ran a stop arm. I, that would be totally heart throbbing, just terrible news. As for Kay, she isn't concerned for her son riding now or in the future, as long as everyone follows the rules. Reporting in Bismarck, Sanji Milburn, KX News. In Bismarck, buses run 49 routes, Mandan runs 28. Keep it here, still ahead, being a new